Oh, hey, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of all ages, <laughs> hey, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of all ages, and welcome to another edition of the Senate Shorts. I'm your host, Neil. He is your host, Derek. Yeah. And together, we are bringing you another short version of the Senate podcast. Now, like, comment, share, subscribe. Just like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything of the only point. Like, and most importantly, share, share, share. Whether you agree with us or disagree with us, let us build the community and get the conversation going and continuing the conversation. Now, brother, man, I got PTSD. Every time you smile, <laughs> right? Every time you smile, calm like that. I just get a little. It's <clears throat> our Twitch, right? So. Oh. Release the house. Release the house. You yes, sure? No. You ready, my brother? No. No. <laughs> uh -oh. But we are right. here. We record the lights here. on. Let me go. Here we go. Female teacher has charges of sex with student dismissed by marrying him. Marital privilege. <laughs> I had to stay in this one for last. <laughs> well, I saved the best for last, but that's what it is. Yes, yes, yes. You can always save the best for last. Right. Marital privilege means that the student cannot be compelled to testify against teacher, making it very difficult to prove case in court. A former high school teacher in Jasper County, Missouri, has reportedly had a charge of alleged sexual contact with a student dismissed after she married him. Bailey Turner, 26, was charged in February 2019 with having sexual contact with a male student after the case was investigated by the Jasper County Sheriff's Department, the Joplin Globe reported. The charge against a former Sarkozy High School teacher for having alleged sexual contact with a student has been dismissed in light of their subsequent marriage and its impact on prosecution of the case. Bailey A. Turner, 26, was charged in February 2019 with having sexual contact with one of her male students after an investigation by the Jasper County Sheriff's Department. Turner was in the middle of her first year of teaching English at Sarkozy High School when a case arose that she'd had sexual intercourse with a student the week of January 14th to 21st, 2019, and she resigned from her position. She had taught at the district's middle school for two years before taking the position at the high school. The Sarkozy School Board subsequently voted to petition the state to have her teaching license revoked. Nate Daly, an assistant prosecutor in the case, told the Globe that the charge against her was being dismissed in light of the defendant having married the student in question. Daly said that because marital or spousal privilege not applies, her former student can no longer be compelled to testify against her, making the state's case exceedingly difficult to prove in court. Daly said that Turner has surrendered her state teaching license, which has been a primary concern of the prosecutor's office in the case. The probable cause affidavit filed in the case did not provide the student's age. State law prohibits sexual contact with the student by the school district employee, volunteer or official, either elected or appointed, regardless of whether the student is a minor or of age for consensual sex. Turner is one of six young educators in Southwest Missouri to be accused in recent years of having sexual relationships with a student. This charge has also been filed against teachers or student teachers in Joplin, Webb City, Monette, Diamond, and McDonald County Schools. Boy, it is wild in Missouri. <laughs> to all. Wild. To all. Oh, to all. I ain't number to complain. Now, I found it strange that they didn't, um, because I was, I was trying to, I, I, I was thinking that this was a minor, but as, as I understand coming on to any article, it's not that it's a minor, it's that she has sexual contact with a student, right? And yeah. obviously that is inappropriate for reasons I don't even feel that like we need to get into. Um, so, in, and, and we all know that at some time you can be of age and still be in high school. Yeah. Um, I think what what was particularly confusing to me is how do you have a law on the books where everything already know that y'all married? I mean, 
<laughs> he's still a student, but he's your husband, so I'm gonna continue. Yeah, do you good? That's still illegal contact with the student. But I am no lawyer. I have no legal training. I am not a legislator. I don't know nothing to do with nothing to do. I don't. I'm not a nothing to do with law. So maybe um, in the comment sections, any of our lawyer friends can possibly give us some insight into how this works. But I will say that this is wild. I really do detest people that take the innocence of children, even though I don't think his innocence was taken by this woman. Think so either. We, we know how we were at 17, 18, 19. Yeah, but I still feel that children should be children. And plus two, if you are, okay, you're 26. Oh, there's 26, right? Mm -hmm. Right. The woman is 26. Let's say the man is 18. You can't wait two years. Check the man profile on Facebook or, or Instagram or nothing. And get that conky lick out. I mean, you could be 20 years. just wait till he left school. He like, even got like, two years. Like, like, I, don't really school I really understand. That is, of course, if this is a situation where he is a senior in high school now. Obviously, we don't know the age of the child. They did not specify the child. We do not know the age of the student. Um, it was not specified if the child was the student was in middle school, was a junior, it's freshman. It, it didn't mention anything like that. So, it, and, and six cases in as many years in Missouri. Like, what were they doing? They're doing. <laughs> and it's just wild for people, people, children. Like, I don't understand. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand. I always have a problem with, with that kind of thing. I think adults should do adult things with adults and children should do children things with children. And they shouldn't be raw streams or polluting each other's whatever, right? And yeah, if you a teacher, teach your children. No one, yeah. You teach an English, teach your English. Like, yeah, how sex I'd get him. Yeah, don't, you know don't, I mean? don't, don't. And I always wondered, how do you... You know what? I don't even want to know. But like, it's it's just it's just a very weird thing for me. I think I don't even know what to say. Well, why can't I get up? But man, left the people children alone. Man, left the people children alone. I never thought I would have to tell anybody that. If I find out that any of y'all troubling students, shoot, are you making my life's mission to get one out to the school system? I find one of teaching in prison. You understand? <laughs> Cause clearly. So here wrong with y'all. I don't. I don't like. I don't like that behavior. I don't like that behavior at all. I don't know what to say there. Like, this is just <laughs> disgusting. I'll tell you this. What what I, I, I extrapolated from it too is the. I had a conversation with a friend of mine today, well, earlier today, and he made the point that women are survivors. Right? Women will find a way to survive. And that's what she did. She found a way to survive. She found a loophole, a loophole get the license, so she can't teach now. Like, we're gone. But at least she's not going to, to prison. You know what I mean? Because there's, there's no case. So she's found a way to survive. And it's interesting because we like to think that, you know, the... No, I use the word, but hey, they are really much ways to get wrong it. But the sexual assault of minors is a man thing. But apparently, it's even more prevalent amongst female teachers, right? So that that's an interesting bit of information as well. And as you say, you just left people children. Let children be children. Like my gay learning and gay GD and like. Come yeah. to you when you need. Yeah, you know the thing is, we we we, we came up, we, we went to school, we both went to the same school. You know, we have seen, you know, certain situations unfold that we like. You know, Ooh. this is a right, this this is look right, Ooh. and um, we understood as teenagers what they were. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So I, I can say this to my male and female teachers out there. You know. Just, as Neil said, let children do children things. Yeah, we, we understand that sometimes children can develop more quickly physically and, and, and that's such a look older than they really are. Um, I know we live in times where children, you know, are partying with adults. 
so now it is real easy to get confused if you're in a, a party situation lighting makeup drinks be up we get it but there's a certain line that you don't cross or rather sorry that you shouldn't cross when you are supposed to be delivering instruction to, t- to your children you know what i mean so try your best to let your people children you know what i mean let children do children things let each other grow up mm-hmm. yep. right let each other grow up yeah sure this, this one does it short like and share oh, this is great hit the notification bell to make sure you don't miss any content we got coming for you guys we can see you guys again soon the contaminated environment in the tutus about that